there's a big difference between corny and cringy. Yeah, for sure. I think corny is endearing, and cringy is, yes. I guess, I guess cringy is really when you try to be endearing, but it just it's doesn't work. It's, yeah, it's when you cringe. It's like, it, or when you make someone cringe, when you're doing something that makes someone, like, have, a, you know, a reaction to it that shows they're very uncomfortable with what, whatever you're doing. <laughs> Stuff that's, like, actually kind of hard to watch. Like, that show, oh my god, have you ever seen, um, on, like, Facebook or anything that show The Button? The Button? Yeah, it's a speed dating show. It's like one of those BuzzFeed type videos where they just kind of bring like real people, not actors, but it's like the same people in every video and everything like that. Oh, uh, um, no, no, I haven't. Oh, well, I I watch um I watch Cody Ko on YouTube and he was doing a couple things with it. Honestly, yeah, like it's funny on its own, but I suggest watching the Cody Ko video because you know it's it's like one of those H three H three things where it's kind of a watch along, um, so you can see it while getting the funny commentary. <laughs> oh, gotcha. At least, right? Yeah, but uh, it, oh my god, dude, it's so awkward. Like some of the shit that happens because it's like you know either some dude like trying to turn a girl on or he's like trying to get really into something or talk about something he's like really into and you can just tell how to be like feigning interest and basically what happens is they have to wait for the button to glow and they hit the button and that's like you're rejected you know like I, I want someone new and so they literally have to like they'll just be talking and it'll you know you have to be really you know some people are just like alright I mean I don't want to like date this person and like you know risk running the time limit or whatever but now you gotta hurt their feelings right because you hit the button just because you don't think they're attractive or something like, you have to say that <laughs> that's rough you have to say that yeah dude that's you have harsh. to literally just be like and i mean obviously they say shit like oh you know this wasn't my type or whatever like try to keep it nice like they're human beings but mm -hmm. it's you know you can tell when oh it's God. like the person really just sits down and then boom hits the button it's just like, oh, okay. So you just think I'm ugly. Like, <laughs> like now I feel bad about my physical appearance. Like, I, I came here to do a little, like, fun thing for the internet, and now I'm now my self-esteem is <laughs> Yeah, right. Now I gotta hurt your feelings, and... Um, or, Jane, yeah, get you, your... You need to watch Tokyo Tony Finding Love ASAP. Uh, Sabrina to talked to me about it in a Donkey Kong video, and... I still have not been able to get through the first episode, but it's so bad, and it's so. She's the meanest bitch in the world, and all these dudes are still like, "Yeah, man, like, she, oh, I'm, she's got a hard exterior, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna crack it." She never met a man like oh me before, God. and she's literally, like, all these guys show up to her house, and she's like, "Oh, you guys want to date me and all that," and they're like, "Yeah, like Tokyo Tony," and then she's like. She literally says, I bet everyone here has a small dick. And she's like, P people better oh. not be wearing white socks. If you're wearing white socks, get the fuck out of my house. And then it cuts to this dude being like, now she's all like, motherfuck this and motherfuck that. But she's nice. And I'm like, where? When? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Off camera, maybe. Yeah, they cut all that out or something. Like... Yeah, and they, then she yeah, she goes they, to this dude, um, and she goes, she, she goes to this dude, and she goes, if I told you, she's like, an inch away from his face. It's like, if I told you to sit down and eat my motherfucking pussy, would you do it? And he just goes very calmly, um, yeah, I think I would. It's so ridiculous. Oh snap! He fell into the stratosphere. That's a good time. It's crazy. James, we just killed a man, and we're here talking about crazy women. It's more important. That's true, man. Women run the run the world. I think Beyonce said that. Who run the world? Girls. Yeah, I was going to say. You're supposed to respond. <laughs> you just like, I... I I don't. I honestly don't know. <laughs> I, I I thought it was a group of leaders, you know, who are usually uh, elected. 
thought it was the Valkyrie. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how come he gets to keep the lightsaber? I want the lightsaber. My spies have located another Jedi. I mean, he has to add it to his collection. Grievous <laughs> the whole time. <laughs> oh my God. Could it be? Did we actually really ever see him die? Yeah, yeah very brutally, actually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. His his chest burst into flames. Yeah. <laughs> and then his eyes blew up. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Dude, that was gruesome for children. Yeah. He was like... He was like... <laughs> just dying. Oh, that was fun. That was a good, that was a good time. See... That movie, that was a good one for the pre. That was the fucking like. I mean, like I, I still think episode three was a fucking fire ass movie. I mean, like, yeah, the the definitely the originals are the best. That's just a fact. Yeah. But like, I don't know, man. Like it, it it's still like, just you know the um effects of it it doesn't look terrible. You know what I mean for its time. No, there's some. I think for. <laughs> some movies it's kind of weird i don't know a lot about excuse me um computer graphics but some stuff still looks really good and then it, within the same movie you'll see it like something else and you're like huh that didn't age well but i wouldn't know like yeah. why one thing does and one thing doesn't um i'm, I'm wondering if that would have more to do with like you know, just kind of like where they where they were at as far as like you know deadlines and everything like that. Like, all right, today we need to accomplish like this much of the script, right? And or like you know, for I'm saying for that department, you know, not necessarily like filming it and doing whatever. And like we have this deadline to do that, so they were like, "Fuck it, let's just make this look passable and then move on," you know. To whatever we want to work on more or you know what I, you know what I, you kind of get what i'm saying though yeah i would like hope that's not the not... attitude because then you're just gonna have you know a weird looking iron man in the airport and uh a weird hulk buster looking thing so wait what i was not paying attention honestly what am i supposed to do i can zap things I... now, which is badass that is badass but how will that um, help me? Well, I think you just gotta follow the map and find out. Oh my god, what the dick just hit me. Oh wait, I like zap stuff and then... Oh, it like created part of the... Was that land always there in my state? Whoa, what the hell? I wanna get the thing. I'll deal with it. Oh, okay. Forest point. I want to get them force points. Oh god! Oh my god! Was it worth it? There we force go. Points? <laughs> force points. Force points. <laughs> this is a this is a crazy freaking world, honestly. Oh my god, Eric! Yeah. I did something I think you would find funny while I was at work today. What, what um, happened? We have we have like a a broccoli rob and sausage dinner entree um mm -hmm. on the menu and like someone ordered it and i went back to the cook and i hung up the ticket and i went brock robster <laughs> <laughs> oh james you know how to get me uh yeah that is pretty funny did i go the wrong way <laughs> not stupid oh Oh, oh, oh! Sorry, I had an Italian spasm. <laughs> <laughs> oh! I got, hit, I got I got hit in the face with a meatball and just started freaking out. <laughs> I just went, oh, hey, oh, hey. You know what's funny? That does sound like an episode of Family Guy. I'm pretty sure it's, um, it's actually, I'm referencing Mr. Pickles, actually, because as much as I said, 
that that destroyed me and everything, I did continue to watch it because I hate myself. And um, oh, okay. so yeah, but they had a they they were like t there was a mob thing and they were like looking for. They were trying to like get money from someone because they were loan sharks. And they walk in the bar and they're just like, hey, oh, hey. <laughs> 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 that shit's just so funny to me. <laughs> James I think that's a show I can. I just like need to watch with my brother because <laughs> he's the only one I can like. <laughs> or not the only one, but one. He's like. He will fucking spend hours just getting in a fucked up mindset with me. That's the kind of brother you need. Yeah. My brother and I will watch uh, Batman and Robin every now and then. And that, I think, is similar. It just messes up our brain chemistry for a few hours. Hell yeah, dude. I mean... No, yeah. You you guys definitely, like, have those... like have those couple things that you you go full ham into as far as you know you want like with batman you fucking got all the comics and everything oh yeah like, do I, you're, I love you're probably one of the bigger batman fans that i know personally oh that, that's nice yeah i do i love batman i'm really excited for the new movie me too dude i'm actually very excited robert pattinson has made a lot of lists recently Whoa. of like the top one uh, overrated actors and I disagree with that I really don't think like because not and I'm not trying to say that like he's you know become number one and he totally deserves it I'm saying that like I don't hear about him like a lot you know I don't I'm not like annoyed with the amount of Robert Pattinson in my life you know what I mean like that's what <laughs> I think of when I think of overrated yeah, I think of fair. like you know people People are just obsessed with his work as like a group, and it's yeah. and it just doesn't sense why it's so strong. You know, because for I mean he he's a good actor. You know what no, I mean? He's like really I, good. I don't. Yeah, he's a really good actor. Like I just, yeah, you know, I I would kind of more understand if it was like everything was Robert Pattinson who was just like, oh my god, we need him in this role, he'd be perfect in this role and all this stuff, it's kind of like, yeah, he's just, just like, pretty good actor, you know what I mean? Yeah, he, he doesn't need he's him. in the new stuff he's been in has been interesting and good for sure, it's more just like they're just not your typical movie where I right. don't know, it, I guess if you're trying to think about like old okay fucking jesus oh my god I, I, are you trying to say like like it's kind of like you you want to watch a you know watch something kind of specific to watch yeah i think if you you know i don't think too many people are gonna just be like yeah i'll watch the lighthouse like that's that's kind of like a you're in a mood you're in a specific you're in a you're in the I mood for the oh, lighthouse I Dude. Okay, can I just say, like, this game maybe hasn't aged super well? Yeah, that's it. You can say that. I'd disagree with you and I'd punch you in the face, but you can say it. Okay, well, I think we're gonna have a bit of an argument here. <laughs> yeah. I'm not saying there has to be a freaking lock-on button, but, like, what the fuck is happening? I'm trying to... Are you saying... Like you just are swinging, and it seems to be just like I'm going over here. No, I'm going over here. People are shooting at me, and I'm trying to throw things at them. And then, or I was trying to zap the little uh, hover thing that they were on, and it was like, oh, you wanna you wanna actually pick up this barrel six feet away from you? And you're like, no. <laughs> oh, behave. <laughs>